This is Sampriti Chakraborty from Ivory Professional School. Today I am going to present a real-time dataset based on airline passenger satisfaction. These are the contents of my presentation which includes objectives, data dictionary, data processing, snapshot of data, dashboard and insights. This is my data set which I have taken from Maven Analytics which includes ID, gender, age, customer type, type of travel, class, flight distance, departure and arrival delay, departure and arrival time convenience, ease of online booking, check-in service, online boarding, gate location, onboard service, seat comfort, legroom service, cleanliness, food and drink, in-flight service and Wi-Fi service, entertainment, baggage handling, and satisfaction. The objectives of my report are to analyze various factors to improve customer satisfaction using age, gender, travel class, customer type, and entertainment options. I have used Power BI and I have presented it through PowerPoint. There are 24 columns in total, but I have used only 15 columns. Next, I have cleaned my data by treating the missing values in Power BI, which I would like to show. So this is the Power Query Editor. And if there are any null or missing values in a column, then we have to go to the Transport, Transform tab. And here there are replace values. In the replace values, This, if this is null or if the, uh, this doesn't contain anything, then I'll replace it with zero or null. And then after I click OK, it will be updated. So let's go back. So this is the snapshot of my data. And here is my dashboard. This is an interactive dashboard. Uh, where I have found out the total passengers by summing up the customer ID. And I have also found out the average of arrival delay and departure delay and also the average of flight distance. I have also found out the satisfaction rate by inserting a donut chart where there is only 43% uh, of passengers who are satisfied and 57% of passengers are not satisfied. Likewise, I have also represented gender wise using our donut chart and also the customer type. Here 82% passengers who have voted are returning. They have traveled more than one time and 18% of passengers uh, are traveling for the first time. Here I have inserted five of uh, Ratings and I have found out the ratings using DAX function and the function is this. I have likewise found out the in-flight service, food and drink, gate location and ease of online booking. I have also inserted a tree map to denote the travel class which includes business class, economic class and economic plus class. I have also inserted a matrix chart to uh, showcase the satisfaction rate by age group.
here we can see that 83% of younger passengers who are below the age of 17 years need to be taken care of mostly as the rate of dissatisfaction is highest among all the other age groups. Next, 81.24% of passengers traveling in economic class are not satisfied with the services. There are three services which have received very low ratings and needs immediate improvement. Those are Wi-Fi service, ease of online booking and gate location. Only 18% of passengers traveling for the first time has voted, which needs to be taken care of. Hence, I have covered all the points that can be done to improve the customer satisfaction. That's all from my side. Thank you.